Uh, today we thought we'd pass along a safety tip on sight glass safety. It's pretty easy to be walking through the plant and notice a leak on your sight glass and just pull your channel locks out and give it a little snug, see if that stops the leak. One of the things you got to be concerned about when you do that is if it possibly cracks or busts the glass and the, the unit is under pressure, this is a deaerator tank or it could be on your boiler or something else, is you want to isolate it before you tighten it. You also want to have on proper safety gear to help protect yourself in case something does go wrong. So what we'll do, we'll, we'll put the safety gear on and then we'll move on. So what we did is uh, we added a long sleeve shirt, gloves, made sure we had our safety glasses on and put on a face shield. Once we get that done, we're ready to start on it. The first thing we want to do is we want to shut off the valves. If we shut off the valves, we can take care of whatever it is we want to as far as tightening us, replacing the glass washers, whatever it is we're going to do. You'll also notice these uh, hanging down. That's a protector for the sight glass. If yours has those, you really ought to make sure you put them back in place. A lot of times we'll find that they're not in place. Once we're done, we think we're ready to go. Then we'll open up the valve one at a time, watch for leaks, open it the whole way. No leaks, we're done. Why we want all this stuff is particularly at this point when we open the valves back up, if the glass would happen to shatter or blow out, we have some protection to keep the glass and keep the heat from tearing us up initially. So that's why we want to prepare this way. It's pretty common that we'll see that little leak and we'll just give it that little touch. But if we do that, we don't have on the safety gear and the glass shatters, that can be a problem. So get the safety gear right, make sure you shut off your valves then do what you're doing. Complete what you're doing, open the valves back up, make sure there's not a leak, and you can go on. Well, hey guys, how are you doing? A little blast from the past, Jeff Bartow, former uh, employee here at Ware Boiler University. Actually, the guy that started Boiler University. Uh, just a tremendous amount of knowledge that talks a little bit about safety. I'll uh, always love that video that he did, wanted to give that to you. Doing things a little different, obviously, during this COVID. I don't have Tyler, so I'm, I'm having to film my own uh, outro here. Uh, but certainly appreciate you tuning in. I hope that you guys are doing well. Again, thankful for all that you guys are doing, keeping the country running. Boilers and steam and hot water are so very important and vital to um, everybody involved. Well, like us on Facebook and follow us on Twitter. If you don't mind, subscribe to our YouTube channel. And as always, please share those videos and we'll see you next time on The Boiling Point.